Good evening there, drivers and future drivers. This is Kevin Barrett, Cypress Truck Line YouTube guy. Uh, sitting here in the Jacksonville yard this evening. I got nothing better to do, so I figured I'd go ahead and do another video for y'all. Welcome to my channel. Or if y'all just coming across me, I do uh, videos. I'm a trainer here for uh, Cypress Truck Lines. I uh, set up this channel, all things Cypress. I just kind of do some recruiting for them. Last few videos has been what I go through with trainees. I did a tarping video, a drywall video. This video, I'm going to uh, go over a uh, backing 48 foot trailer. Trainee backed up today in the parking spot. This is uh, last time backing up in my truck. I had taken some videos when he first started so that he could see what he was doing wrong and this video was his last one so I wanted him to see his improvement from the first time when he started to what he's doing now he's doing a lot better he's getting the getting the trailer into the spot a lot nicer and cleaner and it just it, he learned a lot in the six weeks he was with me um, he's gonna be a good driver for us Hate to see them good trainees get off my truck. I mean, I'm glad to see that they that they succeeded while they were on my truck. But you know, the, this week I'll be by myself. But next week I'll have to start all over again with a new guy, and that's my life. You know, so I get a good guy, and then I get a bad guy. Maybe a couple bad guys, a couple good guys. Just that's what I do. So a uh, little bit about myself. Um, I've been driving for 24, going on 24 years now. I've been with Cypress 12 years, been training with them for seven. I uh, really like working for this company. That's why I, I run this channel. Um, do me a favor. If you, when you, when you come on my videos, hit that like button. Let me know that you, you guys watch these videos and you're liking what I put out. Or hit the don't like button, you know, just be honest with it. Say, hey, you know, that, that that wasn't worth my time watching, you know. I try to keep them short. I don't try to make them too long and drawn out because then you just lose interest and you, you go on to the next video. I mean, I watch a lot of YouTube videos too. And if something doesn't catch my attention, okay, on to the next one. So hit that like button. I said, if you want to subscribe, I think I'm up to close to 70 subscribers now. I get, every time I come on the yard, I'll walk through the yard and guys, new guys in the school or in, or in, they say, hey, you're that YouTube guy. Yeah, that's me, I'm the YouTube guy. I ride around here in uh, truck 25006, I call it the Renegade, dark blue truck, Cypress, uh, 2019 Ultra Loft Peterbilt with uh, chicken lights on it. I carry my, uh, fly my Trump flag inside and I usually got a, I don't know if you guys can see them in this video, I got my LEDs strung out through the, throughout the cab. I change the color from time to time. Sometimes it's green, tonight it's purple. Got these little lights here too, they, they're purple. Light up the flag a little bit. Um, usually I have an American flag hanging off the side of my truck. So I, I stick out like a sore thumb when I'm riding around. So, like I said, if you enjoy the videos, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. I'm always trying to put out different things, try to give you guys information about the company. I like to answer questions. I got guys that call me, text me, send me messages on Facebook, Messenger, send me uh, comments on the, leave comments on the videos below. You know, I try to answer the questions and respond to them as they come in. So, I mean, this is, I'm here for you guys. I want, I want you to get as much information about trucking as you can. I said I got 24 years experience. There's not much that I haven't experienced doing this job. Something that I really enjoy doing. So, um, and Cypress doesn't pay me to do these videos. This is all on my own. I don't get paid. I'm not a recruiter. I'm a driver. I'm an OTR driver. I'm the uh, top dog driver. Last three years, 
run the most miles in the company. So I'm out here on the road. I'm doing the job. I'm not going to sugarcoat this, the company for you and, and make you come here. I'm going to tell you like it is because that's how I feel about the company. It's my personal opinions of it. I think it's a great company and I like to I like to share it with other people. So without further ado, let's get to the backing video. At the end of the videos, I always put up the recruiting number, my business card. It's also got my personal cell phone number on it. I won't answer the phone right off the bat if it's a number I don't know, but feel free to leave a text message. Say, hey, YouTube guy, I seen your video. I got some questions I'd like to talk to you about getting into trucking and let you know and I'll let you know what it is and what it's all about. So enjoy and y'all have a great evening. And here we go. All right, so here we go. Here comes the Renegade coming down the parking lot here at the Loves in Yemassee, South Carolina. Backing up a uh, 45 foot, well not 45 foot, 48 foot trailer, split axle, 10 foot spread getting this set up now he's going over three spots he's going to cut it out to the right then he's going to swing it back to the left so that he sets his trailer up at a 45 degree angle and come on Barrett move the bed there we go there's he's at a 45 degree angle now I pulled up a little bit too far which you're going to see when he starts his back up when I get lined up in the space here you're going to see as he comes around he's going to come into that see where he's coming right in yeah, he lined up at the wrong spot. Uh, but he notices it. He's starting to fix it now. He's going to realize, oh, I pulled up too far. I'm not going to make that spot. Boom. He realizes he's too far over. So he's going to move. He's going to pull forward to move his trailer out a little bit more. So he can come into that parking spot with uh, at a 45 degree angle. We tried to get a spot where there was a guy on the right side parking spot, but the first time he lined up for this spot, the guy was ready to leave, so he took off. So he ended up with an extra space on the right-hand side. But he's been doing, he did pretty good about getting in between two trucks toward the end there. Now he's a little close for comfort, but see how he's coming in now? He's got to cut it a little sharper to get it in. He realizes he needs to go in sharper, so he's going to start cutting it in sharp. See, so he's, he's way too far over to the right. He realizes it right about there. So he's going to pull up. Because he realizes he's too far over. So he's going to pull up and he's going to back in. He's got to cut a little bit sharper into that spot. Which he's going to do, I believe, on this turn as he comes in. He's coming around now. Now he's really going to cut it sharp. He's going to get it into that spot. Notice he's keeping his wheels close to the uh, left line. Giving him plenty of room on the right side. He's got a nice cut right there. He's coming in nice and smooth. Coming right around. Staying in his staying in his spot. He's still a little too far to the right. Which he just realized was when he came around he realized his tires were way too far off that line. So he's gonna pull up. Like I tell these guys, you're not taking a CDL test. I don't care if you pull up a thousand times. Pull up, get set up with the spot. And he knows there's not a truck on the right hand side, so he's got a little more free play but if there was a truck on the right hand side I would suggest that he get out and look he's, you know in the in industry we say you know you got to use your goal you got to get out and look I don't care if you get out and look a hundred times so to see he doesn't come back too far realizes he's gonna come into that other spot so he's gonna pull forward so he's gonna get into a straight back situation Right there, he's pretty much in a straight back situation. He's just got to cock the trailer and truck around just a little bit to come right into that spot. So there he goes. He's, he's lining up with the spot now. He can see both sides nice and easy. Now he's a little bit too close on the left, but he's in his spot, so you can't really complain. 
it could have moved over a little bit more but at this point it looks pretty good we'll let it ride come on back come on back now the mud flaps on this truck aren't too low so you can go ahead and back it all the way up and, and tap that curb and not worry about ripping them mud flaps off you see how high the mud flaps are compared to the curb so there you have it like i say let recruiting know that youtube guys sent you and y'all have a great evening